We'll get to those stories and your forecast here in just a minute. But first, breaking news as we come on the air. We are learning more this evening about last month's deadly crashes on the Ohio Turnpike. And for the first time, we are learning the Turnpike's new toll plaza system may be to blame. This has been a focus of our 11 Investigates team since the crash happened back on August 15th. Lead investigator Brian Duggar joins us live in studio with these brand new details. Brian. Yeah, Jeff, this is what we know. I just got my hands on a series of supplemental reports from the Ohio State Highway Patrol. These reports go into detail about what troopers saw and heard in the moments and hours after those deadly crashes. Now, according to the report, the driver in a car involved in the initial crash told a trooper from her hospital bed that she slowed from 70 to 50 miles per hour to avoid missing the eastbound Swanton Township Plaza. Her SUV was then hit from behind by a tractor trailer. And this is a key point. The report says she began to cry as she expressed confusion about this new plaza. And in a written statement to troopers, she said they need to change the way it was designed. Her husband and son were in the back seat and died in that initial crash. Two other people died in separate crashes. Now exit 49 began operating in April and has been the subject of multiple 11 investigates reports. Hundreds of people have reached out to us after they missed that plaza saying they were confused. But this is the first time that a driver involved in a fatal accident actually blamed plaza confusion. Now an initial NTSB report is expected to be released any day and a turnpike official provided the following statement. The causes of the crashes remain under investigation by the Ohio State Highway Patrol. The National Transportation Safety Board is also conducting a separate independent investigation. We are awaiting the results, so we cannot draw any conclusions at this time. You can find much more about this story on WTUL.com including our previous investigations and the patrol's reports. Reporting in studio, this is Brian Duggar for 11 Investigates.